Hey everyone, welcome to my desk tour. In today's video, I'm just gonna be showing you my desk. So let's get started. So the first part of my desk is this window. It's not really part of my desk, but I just like looking out of it and it really adds to the aesthetic appeal of my room. <laughs> so yeah, that's item number one. And next to that, we have this lamp. I actually bought it off of Amazon and I think I showed the process of me ordering it in a video before i don't know though next to that we have these little postcards that are really cute and super colorful too i got these from aliexpress and yeah that's all <laughs> they're really nice and manny is camera shy for some reason shaking this is Manny the Mannequin. He's from Ikea and he solely serves his purpose as decoration. And to the left of him are these little court organizers. Also to the right there are these tulips that are fake in a vase <laughs> and I got these from Ikea too. In front of all these items I have my laptop that's really fancy and powerful. And I also have this NURB light that changes colors. What? <laughs> I absolutely love this thing and it helps so much with filming. Next to the light, I have this little stationary box thing. <laughs> Funny enough, this was all from Target. Well, not all of it, but the little container. So in the first compartment, I have my Ohuhu brush markers and I keep my skin color set in there because I use that the most. In the front, I have these food erasers. I got these off of Amazon and they're pretty cute and easy to put together as well. Um, so yeah, there's not really much to say about these, except this one is my favorite one because it has strawberries on it. and. It's just so small and cute. I also really like this crepe one because it's a weird color <laughs> for a crepe. Yeah. And next to that, I have this little compartment that's actually pretty long. And I keep my scissors in here. These are just standard fabric scissors. I don't know why I have fabric scissors. Um, <laughs> then I have this. This pack of stickers that I also got from AliExpress that will be shown in an unboxing video one day, I hope, if I can find that footage. <laughs> and I also have, yeah, I don't know why I showed this twice. Um, I think I was trying to open it, but I couldn't get the envelope to open. So yeah, I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> I also have this little fidget cube here that was a gift by a very special person and I usually play with this when I'm kind of anxious or feeling anxious or nervous about something. Um, yeah, it's a pretty nice color too. I think it's like an ocean theme or something but yeah, I really like it and I like to keep it on my desk. <laughs> In front of that, or behind that, I have this pack of stickers that I also got from AliExpress. I haven't opened them yet, but I think I just like seeing the bloom where you are planted thing. I, I just like seeing that, so I haven't opened it. And in the back, I have a paper clip thing and some, a sharpener. Then here I have my erasers. This one has obviously been used too much. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's struggling, but the newer ones are back there. This is my tape dispenser, where I just used this to hang up some of my artwork. And over here I have my highlighters. You might've seen this purple one in my other video. I think it was the two hand challenge video and 
yeah, they're pretty standard, but they're reliable. Over here, I have my Ohuhu fine liners and brush markers. Those have been lifesavers. And this right here has also been a lifesaver. This is my, let me flip it around. This is my Uniball Signo pen. I have about five of those. And here I have my flashlight and some other pens and pencils. And now we're at the wall. There's actually a story behind this piece and the piece that's under it. I had these brown frames in my room and I just wanted to create it, <laughs> create it, create two pieces that would fit with the aesthetic of my desk and also bring some balance as well. Over here, I have some more of those little postcard things I got from AliExpress. And I like looking at this side of my desk because there's some really cute little messages that are written on the cards like a sweet day, come on flower, happy, happy, happy. <laughs> and yeah, it just really inspires me to create art. This right here is actually one of my OCs. I don't want to call it an OC, but it's one of my OCs. I literally haven't done anything else with that OC. But yeah, she's just chilling there, you know, having a good time. Then there's more postcards right there. And yeah, happy school day. <laughs> and now, this is my chair. There's nothing too fancy about this chair. Um, I got it from the basement, threw a blanket on it. The blanket's pretty soft. Yeah, yeah. And here is where the, the real fun happens. This is where I store my Prismacolor Premier color pencils. And let me just try to open this. That way you all can see what it looks like. Ta-da! Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's a color pencil missing? What? <laughs> but yeah, that's where I keep my color pencils because I can't store them anywhere else in my room. Then I have this little pencil bag with some extra pens in it. But yeah, let's close that. Oh, and please don't mind that. It doesn't usually look like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> we're not going to talk about that. Okay, now we're at this part of my desk. So these are just storage units. The first unit is this little drawer. And I keep my Uniball pens here, some business cards, a light bulb, screen protector, and... Then I have these, which are my pencils that I use for sketching. I think you all have seen these before. Maybe not the entire case, but a couple of them. This kit, I actually got it from Amazon and it was really affordable. I think it was about $10. These are the pencils that I use the most, along with the auto pencils. And yeah, they're really good quality, so I recommend that you check these out. Apparently, I double recommend them. <laughs> I don't know what that double thumbs up was about. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is insane. Okay, next up, these are the leftover postcards that could not fit on my wall. I just put them in here just in case one of them falls off or something or I get some more room. Then back there, I just have some random little knickknacks. Knickknacks? Is that a word? We're just gonna move on. We're just gonna move on. Okay. <laughs> Here I have my hoo hoo markers. These are the leftover ones. Um, I'm actually thinking all the colors that aren't in the the skin color set are in here. Let's open this up and see what's inside. Yes. These are all the colors and I just keep them safely tucked away in this bag. And over here I have my sketchbook, sketchbook, folders, another folder, and then documents. So nothing too fancy in there. And then down here, hold on, let me zoom out. Okay, down here I have some of my cards. 
actually use these cards whenever someone orders a commission. I just write them a little thank you card and then I put it in with their commission. Then back there I have my webcam and envelopes and some other folders. Yeah, nothing too special. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed seeing what my desk looks like. And honestly, this video showed me that it's very hard to record a voiceover for something that is timed. So <laughs> I hope you all liked that. Please leave any suggestions that you have for future videos. But yeah, bye.